if you like button mashing games, Sifu is a great one to get into. But you can experience some stutters with it. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Canada Technology and in this video we're going to talk about how you can fix stuttering issues in Sifu. So Sifu is a relatively lightweight game which should function on your system fine but in case it doesn't, the first thing we're going to do is to update our GPU drivers. Now uh, the easiest way to do this is to just open up your uh, Nvidia app or uh, AMD or Intel app depending on what GPU you have and going to check for drivers. So if you have Nvidia, just fire up the Nvidia app, head over to drivers and then you'll have the option of checking for driver updates right here if there aren't any already available. Uh, another thing to keep in mind is that you're using game ready drivers and not studio drivers because uh, these two drivers can actually make a big difference in how uh, your games are run on your GPU. If your GPU driver is up to date, you should also check your uh, NVIDIA and AMD control panel settings. For example, if I open my NVIDIA control panel, there is um, a default refresh rate setting that NVIDIA automatically sets to programs. Uh, for example, if I zoom in here and go down, you will see that uh, there is a max frame rate setting which is set to whatever the frame rate of my particular monitor is, which is 144 FPS uh, or 144 Hertz. So it's 144 FPS right here. If you're looking at program specific settings, and uh, let me see if I can find Sifu in this list. In any case, go through the rest of your settings as well, just to make sure that everything is set uh, to the way you like it and that the maximum frame rate setting is also set to something well so that the game isn't being throttled by your GPU itself. If fixing NVIDIA settings did not fix uh, the problem you were having, then what we're going to do is open up the run prompt by pressing Windows key plus R and I'm just going to uh, head over to the app data folder by typing in percentage app data percentage sign press enter. In here we are going to local so we'll go back to app data click on local here we need to find the Sifu folder double click save then click on config you will have uh, the WinGDK file and then you will find the engine.ini file here. I'm going to right click and open this with notepad and now let me just drag and drop it here. So what this file has is a bunch of commands and configurations for how the game run. What we are going to do is that we're going to add this command which you will find uh, in the description below. Just copy paste this here, click uh, save the file by pressing Ctrl S, close it and now you can try restarting your game and the stuttering issues should be gone. If you like this video, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such videos can we make for you. If you'd like to know more about tech, visit our website candid.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter and we'll see you on the next video.